Purdue Mandalorian. There's a, a few things that kind of start to stack up on each other if you're thinking about fitness. And what I wish someone told me 27 years ago is that breathing is the most important thing, right? It's They say you could go three days without food or water, give or take. You could go three hours in an unhospitable environment, right? Either too cold or too hot. And then you could go three minutes without air. So if you haven't been taught formally how to breathe, that might be a great place to start because it'll help you be relaxed in high pressure situations on and off the field. Um, there's a great video by this doctor. Her name is Dr. Vranich. It's a TED talk. It's called How to Breathe. That's V-R-A-N-I-C-H. I talk about it in almost every single video I make because it's like the, it's a foundational thing, right? They say a pyramid is only as big as its base. So if you give yourself this breathing, right, you learn this breathing technique, it's a breathing skill, she calls it, then, you know, your endurance is gonna improve, your stamina is gonna improve, um, you're gonna be able to last longer, train harder, or maybe at a higher intensity, but also being very relaxed. So I think it's, it's a game changer. At least uh, for me, it was a game changer. So I think that, that'd be a great place to start. Um, something else that really has changed um, my fitness level has taken it to the next level is called an RMT rope. And let me show you how it works. It's basically just a long, it's a long piece of rope, right? As long as you are tall. But the beauty is the simplicity, right? Because you can start to swing this, right? you start to swing it around and you're breathing. And right now we're gonna get some core, we're gonna get some rotation in the, in the spine, and the hips. We're breathing, we can start to pivot the feet if you like. So it's basically just a great tool to facilitate. It kind of unlocks your movement capabilities because you're gonna get into positions and movement that you wouldn't naturally do. It would almost look goofy if you did it without any physical object. So for that reason, this is just a great tool, right? From your local hardware store, or you could order one on, online. I think it's more fun to make, but you can order one online. It's called an RMT rope. But soft piece of rope, you know, you could duct tape the ends, and then you wanna to start to learn, right? You can start to learn different patterns. You go high, you go low, right? So you're gonna get in lots of different ranges of motion. This is gonna help you become more agile. It's gonna help you become more explosive. Um, I noticed my juggling started to, to improve, my, which improved my shooting, which improved my passing. Everything just got better, to be honest, when I started using this rope. Um, and then there's one pattern in particular that will take you, a, a, it took me a three days to learn. Um, it's called the alternating underhand sneak. It looks like this. And why it's so powerful is because it mimics, um, it helps you learn perfect running technique Right, because it's gonna whip your arm. You whip your arms down, and your leg pops up. So now you're really working on the hip flexor and your calves. It's kind of just, it's just so profound because it's so simple yet so powerful. Um, I made one of these ropes. I trained a, I was a second assistant coach at the local college here. As my going away gift, I made everyone RMT ropes, and I'm pretty sure no, no one uses it, but it's the thought that counts, right? So. I'm telling you, between the, that that breathing video and um, this RMT rope, you could change your life effortlessly, effortlessly. Uh, something else that might help, cold showers, you know, Wim, Wim Hof, you could search Wim Hof. He does a lot of cold plunging just to get the morning started. Um, it's going to help, you know, most people have access to showers. And, and if you could change your physiology by dropping your temperature... It's going to boost your testosterone. It's going to lower your cortisol, your, your ability to um, be relaxed in stressful situations like in a cold shower can really help improve not only your breathing and your resilience to, to uh, get a catch a cold. Um, it's going to just make you more badass. So I think that's something that I wish I started doing earlier in life. Um, cold, cold, get into a cold tub or a cold, cold uh, shower is... Um, really just changes the trajectory of your day, I believe. So that's something else that you can start doing. That's gonna shred you out too. Um, and one last thing that's pretty effort, super effortless, 
Um, they say you spend the most of your most of your time in your bed and in your feet, right? So it's hard to change your bed, right? Beds are pretty expensive, but if you change your shoes, right? If you change your shoes, there are some shoes that'll make you worse over time, and there are some shoes that'll make you better over time. I've tested a lot of minimalist shoes out. Um, I've fallen in love with shoes called, they're called zeroshoes.com, X-E-R-O shoes.com. Uh, they've got a pair of shoes that, you know, looks, you know, looks great if you're going to a nice dinner or something like that. Um, and I have some on the way in the mail, so I'm looking forward to those, but, uh, right, because they have a very thin, they have an almost a zero, zero drop heel, so nothing, Jack and you're changing the angle nothing raising the angle of your ankle so you're going to get full range of motion in your ankle when you're walking um, it has a wide a slightly wider toe box right you want your shoes to allow your feet to expand if you take a step you'll notice that your feet kind of spread out so you don't want any shoes that are going to constrict your feet and kind of crush your, your toes your toes are super important for ba balance right so um, just changing your shoes could be just something little that can create huge, huge results. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Um, juggling. If you don't, if you haven't spent a minute a day juggling, and you want to start playing soccer to go into the next level, ask yourself: Can I spend one minute a day juggling? A simple juggling habit, right? A minute a day over a year. That's three hundred sixty-five minutes. That's a lot of minutes that uh, get a lot of good touches. Juggling is going to improve passing, shooting, dribbling. You know. Everything's your your vision, your coordination, your timing, your your rhythm, right? Everything's gonna get better if you just spend one minute a day juggling. So bringing a ball with you every everywhere you go could be a, a great um, strategy to helping improving your fitness. Um, maybe investing in a kick trainer. Right, this kick trainer is fun to use. You could cram months of learning into days or weeks. You could get a lot of touches. Right in ten minutes, walking around the block, walking your dog, or just watching maybe some football or some soccer on TV, you could get close to a thousand touches in ten minutes effortlessly. Um, so for those reasons, you know it's balance again, balance, timing, rhythm, coordination, relaxing. Right, you could play your favorite song, just get you in a great mood. saying this is better than a training partner I'm not saying this is better than you, you know doing a wall ball or using a rebounder um, but it's, it's a perfectly played pass every time and you're just gonna really be able to hone in on your striking technique right really get your first touch uh, perfect so for all those reasons I just think this is one of the best tools that's ever been um, invented in terms of youth soccer or soccer development so this is another great tool this is an SKLZ kick train on Amazon, 24 bucks, or just make one yourself, a size one ball, length of rope, and then just to tie it off with some duct tape. Um, what else? I mean, if you spent any time investing in any of those things, right, the breathing, the arm T rope, um, it'll just change your life. Um, so, so give those a try. Um, Something else that you could check out, check out Kador Zayani. He's got hundreds of free videos online, thousands of free videos online. He's got a book out. The book is excellent. Um, yeah, give those a, give those a try. Uh, there's there's more, but um, those are you know those are foundational, so they can really help you you grow your life. So reach out with any questions. All right, thank you.